but I just had to get this off my chest quickly because it really makes me think about stuff. So I'm on my way back now from dropping off the good kids and all the rest of it. As I'm driving to one shop, I pull up, I see um, the dustman there and the dust people collecting the dustman. And there was this, I keep saying dustman, dustbin. And there was this young lady there. She had the baby and she had the bag issues with her brethren. Anyway, she went to go and put back the bin and she was struggling a little bit. So the man said to her, you know what, let me help you. This is the dustman. She was like, oh, it's all right, I can manage. She said, no, no, you've got the baby. I don't want you to pick up the bin and then you're going to have to pick up the baby when you get to the front door. Let me just help you because of a few steps. So as he's pulling it, she's like, all right. As he's pulling it, he kind of smiled at her and she was like, what? And he was like, what's well, smiling at She's like, but what am I smiling for? Like, what am I smiling Are you smiling at me? Like, I thought you were trying to effort, offer a little help with a dustbin or you're trying to chat me up. Are you trying to chat me up? And he was like, well, you are a nice looking lady, you know, you know, I wouldn't mind. And she was like, are you mad? Are you mad? Look at you, though. Look at you. Like, you're a dustman. You couldn't come chat to me. You want to chat to this and talk to her bridge. Like, he wants to chat to this. Are you mad? Chat to who? Like, furthermore, give me back my bin, innit? Move from here, innit? And he was like, well, why are you going on like that? Why am I going on like that? Because you're a waste man. You're an original waste man, innit? What, how much you earn an hour? What, a penny an hour for picking up rubbish? Move from me. You want to chat to me? Like, I said, disrespect. So he was like, rah, like, you must be single, innit? Because I can't understand how you're going on like that. You want to diss a man because I'm working. She was like, move, this ain't work. What are you collecting rubbish? Move from me. How wonder are you so quick? You probably wanted to chat up the bean. You don't want to chat me. Move from here. So he just was like, you know what? I allow you. And he walked off. Now, I was still in my car taking my time with my little milk because I wanted to see what was going on. So as she's there now, she turned to her brother and she's like, Joker, he couldn't even stand next to my man. Wait, man, he couldn't even stand next to my man. I want to chat to this. And the other friend was like, yeah, I'm nervous that I've all done it. I don't know who these little no piece of man think that they are talking to me with their little idiot jobs. Yeah. She goes, anyway, thinking of man, how's your man? When's he out of jail? P yeah. When's he out of jail? My girl turned to me and said, boy, you know what? He's on remands and all them things there. And they're always on to him. I'm sick of it because at the end of the day, they didn't find no fingerprints or nothing. So I don't know why they're holding him. But you know what? I'm a ride to die, innit? Like I was there the first time. I was there the second time. I was there the third time when he went to jail. And I ain't going nowhere this time when he's in jail, innit? Like I'm there. So like I was saying to you, if you can still have the kids tonight so I can sort out a couple business on road tonight, then I'm nice, innit? Everything's all good about this idiot, man. You couldn't even stand next to man. Look at my man. He's holding it down. He's holding it down in there. So you want to diss a man, yeah, who has a job, a stable job. Maybe it's not to your preference. And maybe some women feel that they wouldn't want a man who works as a dustman. But how dare you disrespect a man because he's got a job, yeah, and you want to call him a waste man. You were smelling yourself. Yourself is waste. Like each their own that want to stand by their man for going to jail. But did you hear what she said? She stood by him the first time, the second time, the third time, and the fourth time. This is why some of you women are single. Because you'd rather take the hype man, the road man, the man that want to do nothing. He ain't got no job, but he's in his house. But because he can strub up his something in your thing so good and make your head spin, you'd rather take that than a man who's stable. And then you were, what hurt me is she was disrespecting the man. She Shannon, waste man. Waste man. Oh, no, sir. That now the work. Women, sometimes we need to fix up. Seriously, we need to fix up. Of course you couldn't stand next to your man because your man's in jail. No, sir. That now the work. Disrespect. Big up all the men that has got their job. I don't business what your job is, innit? Because we don't know the man's circumstances. He could have been some big banker and lost his job and thought to himself, instead of sitting down doing nothing, yeah, he'll go and collect bins and do whatever. But at the end of the day, he's got his stable job. He didn't ask you for no money. He didn't try and beg anything for you. The man first approached you to help you lift down your bin. You're too rude, man. You're too rude, my girl. Seriously. So big up all the man them that's holding down their job. Don't watch anybody that want to try and disrespect you because you know what? You got something that they couldn't have. A job.